The North American Company was a holding company incorporated in New Jersey on June 14, 1890, and controlled by Henry Villard, to succeed to the assets and property of the Oregon and Transcontinental Company. It owned public utilities and public transport companies and was broken up in 1946, largely to comply with the Public Utility Holding Company Act of 1935. Its headquarters were at 60 Broadway in Manhattan. Topic holdings In 1889 New Jersey passed legislation to facilitate the control of other companies by another corporation with a goal of encouraging trusts to convert into holding companies and relocate to that state. To take advantage of these expanded corporate powers, in 1890 Oregon and Transcontinental, which was an Oregon corporation, reincorporated as a holding company in New Jersey and became the North American Company. By 1940, North American was a $2.3 billion holding company directly and indirectly heading up 80 companies. It controlled 10 major direct subsidiaries in eight of which it owned at least 79%. Three of the ten were major holding companies, Union Electric Company of St. Louis, Missouri Washington Railway and Electric Company North American Light and Power Company Four of the ten direct subsidiaries were operating companies, Cleveland Electric Illuminating Company Pacific Gas and Electric Detroit Edison Company Wisconsin Electric Power Company The remaining three of the ten direct subsidiaries were, North American Utility Securities Corporation West Kentucky Coal Company 60 Broadway Building Corporation At various times during its existence, North American also owned substantial interests in these other companies as well, the Milwaukee Electric Railway and Light Company, formed in 1896 as a subsidiary of the North American Company. By 1929, it operated within North American Company along with Wisconsin Electric Power Company, which became the consolidated name of the two operating companies in 1938. It now belongs to Wisconsin Energy Corporation Capital Transit, formed on December 1, 1933 in Washington, D.C. from merger of Washington Railway, Capital Traction, and Washington Rapid Transit. North American owned it through its holding company subsidiary, Washington Railway and Electric Company, which in turn was the holding company for the merged lines, owning 50% of Capital Transit. Potomac Electric Power Company Cincinnati Gas and Electric Company Union Light, Heat and Power of Covington Kentucky Northern Natural Gas Company Butte Electric and Power Company Laclede Gas Company Edison Securities Corporation Wired Radio, Inc. Muzak North American Edison Company North American Company was broken up by the Securities and Exchange Commission, following the United States Supreme Court decision of April 1, 1946. <laughs> Dow Jones Industrial Average North American stock was one of the 12 component stocks of the May 1896 original Dow Jones Industrial Average, but it was replaced later that same year. In 1928, when the number of stocks comprising the DJIA was increased to 30, North American was re-added to the list but was replaced again in 1930. The two periods when it was a component were May 26, 1896 to August 26, 1896, replaced by U.S. Cordage October 1, 1928 to January 29, 1930, replaced by Johns Manville. Topic. See also. John the First Beggs, former director. Clement Studebaker Jr., chairman of North American Light and Power Co.